CYT is 90302 and I wanted to come to you really really quickly with a couple of little items that I picked up from my local Target, um, my local Rite Aid and also I have a surprise for you guys so let me go ahead and get started. The first thing I did was I went over to my local Target and um, I was looking around I was getting some household things and I decided I wanted to try uh, out a BB cream and for all of you who don't know what is a BB cream a BB cream is kinda like a tinted moisturizer it will not give you uh, full coverage if that is what you are seeking but it will give you a very light sheer to light coverage um, that you can set with a powder and it is great for the summer weather because as you know um, the temperatures outside are just soaring right now um, in Maryland we've been having anywhere from 90 to 99 and I actually think we hit 105 one day so who wants to get up in the morning and put on a full face of makeup only to go outside and have it just melt off no so tinted moisturizers and BB creams are like a really awesome item that you can incorporate into your foundation routine and this way you have a light to sheer coverage um, that gives you a little oomph but you're not overly done and it is perfect for the hot weather so the one that I picked up is the Garnier skin renewal and this is in medium deep and I will quickly show you what that looks like and you don't need a lot but that's how it comes out in the tube and if you look at my hand versus it my hand is much darker than this but when you blend this down as you can see it melds right into my skin and it won't give you a matte finish it'll kinda of give you just a little radiant kinda of glow not dewy but radiant and um, I think I like this uh, there are quite a few BB creams that are out on the market matter of fact right now I am currently searching um, my stores because Maybelline has brought out their own version of a BB cream also so I'm trying to get my hands on that um, to try it out but since I'd seen a couple of reviews about the Garnier one I went on ahead and purchased it Smashbox I hear has a really awesome BB cream and if you are also looking at the Laura Mercier Laura Mercier's tinted moisturizers are really awesome as well okay then the next thing that I did was I went and I had to purchase another one of the elf kabuki brushes and if you guys have never tried this brush you really should I had one my daughter came home to visit and so she uh, relieved me of it and so I had to go get another one but it looks like this and when I say this brush surprisingly from elf is probably one of the better 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 brushes that elf has made um, it is super super soft and I really like this brush you know if you don't have a kabuki in your stash you need to get one because it's a great way to make sure that you get everything nicely buffed into your skin and to have it soft and only cost you three bucks is a great deal you can also sometimes if you have a uh, TJ Maxx or Ross in your area you may luck up and be able to find them in there also so definitely check out that kabuki brush then I went over to my local Dollar Tree because when we were when one day we were in the Mavings and we were talking about uh, someone had posted a picture of the L'Oreal hip um, high intensity foundation and they come in bottles like this and it was like no one had really known enough about them but they looked on the internet and we did some research on YT and it supposedly that these were some really awesome foundations why L'Oreal decided to discontinue them I don't know but as you know with most companies when items get discontinued they somehow make it to your local Dollar Tree or your Big Lots so if you have a Dollar Tree or Big Lots in your area you want to start adding that into your your weekly routine of, of store trolling and definitely check out those stores because usually that's when you can find some really awesome products 
for a dollar, three bucks, and you can't beat that. So the very first one that I picked up is number 818, and this is in teak. And I will quickly give you a swatch of what teak looks like. So here is teak on my skin. The very next one that I picked up is number 814 and this one is in Cephia and Cephia looks like this. So here is Teak and Cephia. Teak looks much darker and Cephia is much lighter and I will give you a swatch of that. So. Here is the sepia, and here is the teak. Um, if I blend teak down, it looks like it could be okay for my skin. And here is the sepia blended down. So this one is just a shade lighter, and the teak is probably going to be the better of the two I may even have to slightly mix them together but for a dollar you can't beat this and the coverage uh, I hear is pretty good so if you have a low, uh, dollar tree in your area definitely be on the lookout for the L'Oreal hip high intensity foundations um, you can't beat that so then I stopped into my local Rite Aid because I was watching Lip Shop and she did this wonderful eye tutorial and she used this uh, Jessie Girl eye dust in her inner tear duct. And what it is is when she applied that to the skin, it gave off this teal iridescence. And so I went through my Jessie Girl and I didn't have this one. So I went to Rite Aid because that's the only place in my area that sells them. And the name of that one is called Secret Weapon. And Secret Weapon looks like this in the jar. Just kind of looks kind of white. But what it is is it has this these teal undertones to it so I will quickly swatch that for you so there it is kind of swatched out on my finger and when I swatch it on my hand as you can see you see that teal reflect to it so I really really thought that was gorgeous and I love teals so I had to go to Rite Aid to pick up that one and also while I was looking for that one I decided let me make sure um, there wasn't another one that I didn't have and there actually was two more and this one is called Fruit Punch and Fruit Punch looks like this in the jar and I will give you a swatch so there it is on my finger and there it is swatched out on my hand really really pretty color the next one that I picked up that I didn't have is called pink glitz and pink glitz looks like this inside the jar there it is swatched out on my hand and it's just this beautiful pink with a lot of shimmer and glitter to it so it's a really really gorgeous be great uh, in a tear duct colors alright so those were all the quick little items that I picked up so now on to my surprise well basically the surprise is I have a giveaway for you guys um, and the giveaway is pretty simple all you have to do is be 18 years of age or older be a US resident and you know the drill click the subscribe button definitely subscribe you're missing out on finding some really awesome things um, and I need for each person one comment only one comment do not do the spam thing because if I look back and I see that you've commented more than once unfortunately I am going to have to delete 
all of your comments. So just one comment. And what I want you guys to comment to is, if you could spend the day with me, and I was going to pick up the tab for you to go on a little shopping spree, as far as makeup goes, what is the one most important thing you think you'd have me buy for you? Um, so, leave that information down below. Definitely be 18 years of age or older. Be a U.S. resident and you have to be a subscriber and please I know that a lot of times people subscribe to giveaways for the purpose of a giveaway um, but I'm hoping that you subscribe you stick around you get to know me like I get to know you and we have a great time together alright guys take care here are the prizes that you can win alright so the very first prize in this giveaway is going to be the number 204 B uh, wet n wild mega last polish and this one is in private viewing and it looks like this the next thing that you will be winning is I have been Oh, excuse me, I'm making all this noise in your ears. I'm dropping tops everywhere. I've been talking about these L'Oreal Infallibles. And so, uh, this very next one is going to be number 556. And this is a Smoldering Plum. And Smoldering Plum looks like this. You'll also get number 890. And this is called Bronze Taupe. And Bronze Taupe looks like this. And the third one that you'll get is number 996, and this is called Liquid Diamond. And Liquid Diamond looks like this. And none of these have been opened or used. I'm not going to swatch them in front of you because uh, these have to go out to whoever wins. And the very last thing you're going to get is... Um, I think I hauled this a while ago and I told you guys I went to my CCO and I duped myself. And that drive to the CCO is uh, a beast and I don't feel like going all the way back out there just to return one item so instead you will get the lip glass in social light by Mac and I will quickly pull that out of the box so you can see what that looks like again and there is social light so 18 years of age or older US resident one comment if you could go on a shopping spree with me and I was footing your bill Makeup wise, what's the one thing that you would want me to get for you? All right, guys, thank you once again for your support, and I love you guys. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. Bye.